Now, weather with Chief Meteorologist Jamie Warner. Well, it started off a little on the cloudy side, but this is how the day is ending up. Beautiful out there, mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Temperatures pleasant again today, topping out in the upper 70s. We're sitting at 77 right now, and it's a little on the breezy side out there. Winds out of the south southeast at 20 miles per hour. I guess the number to watch that at least we've been watching all week long is this number right here, the dew point, which has remained very low throughout this week, unusually low for June. That's why it hasn't felt muggy at all out there. That number is going to be creeping higher. Why? We'll take a look at what's going on right now. We've got much higher dew points to our west and southwest. Dew points in the low 70s in parts of central Oklahoma. We've got mid 60 uh, dew points across Kansas. Low 60 uh, dew points into southeast Nebraska. So here's our Gulf moisture. That's one ingredient in what will lead to a wetter pattern going forward through this upcoming weekend. Notice how the air is still pretty dry across the Ozarks. Something else I'm watching, a series of upper level storms. Now one move through today that's why we had the clouds and even a few light showers uh, moving across the Ozarks. Bit of a break here. And then we've got another storm back here across parts of eastern Colorado into the Texas Panhandle. That upper level storm is going to lead to a wave of showers and thunderstorms, which is just now beginning to come together here. That will be translating east overnight tonight and should arrive in the Ozarks ahead of sunrise on Saturday. And right there in a nutshell is the pattern that we're looking at this weekend and beyond in the next week as we're going to continue to find a steady stream of Gulf moisture into the area. We're we're also going to have a frontal boundary in the mix, and we're going to have that steady stream of upper level storms moving from west to east across the region. What that will mean is a very unsettled pattern through the middle of next week. We're going to have a near daily chance for showers and thunderstorms. Heavy rainfall is going to be a possibility at times. Severe weather will be a possibility at times. Right now, I can say that it looks like mainly a wind and hail risk, and I think wind is probably going to be the primary mode. It's also going to be a lot warmer and more humid than we've seen this past week. Here's a look at the severe weather risk going forward through this weekend. Now this is for late tonight approaching sunrise on Saturday. And all in all, I'm not very worried about severe weather. I do think we could get some pretty strong wind gusts maybe into uh, westernmost Missouri, but that threat will diminish further east with those storms that come into the area tomorrow morning. Late tomorrow night into Sunday, I think there will be a better chance for severe storms, especially closer to I-70 or central Missouri, and then that activity will sag south and southeast overnight Saturday night into Sunday morning. Again, wind will be the primary mode, and there could be a lingering threat of uh, some severe weather again on Sunday. Here's our hour-by-hour -hour forecast, and this will illustrate things pretty nicely for you. You can see how that wave of showers and thunderstorms comes into southwest Missouri ahead of sunrise on Saturday. That activity moves east of the area by early afternoon Saturday we will find partly cloudy skies and mostly dry conditions and it's going to be a lot warmer than we've seen with highs tomorrow in the middle and upper 80s. Then overnight Saturday night here comes that next round of showers and thunderstorms coming together that will drop south and southeast across the area through sunrise on Sunday and then once we get into the afternoon on Sunday I think we're just looking at partly to mostly cloudy skies with most areas remaining dry. Here's our seven day forecast and again you can see on Saturday a high of 87 for Father's Day. Again the best chance for showers and thunderstorms will be during the morning. Highs in the low 80s. Monday uh, looks like scattered showers and thunderstorms may be focused again during the morning hours. A chance for a few showers and thunderstorms Tuesday afternoon but that day looks to be drier. Wednesday showers and thunderstorms likely again focused toward the morning hours and then after that we may see things heat up and dry out at least for a couple of days Thursday and Friday. Getting closer to July at that point too. Yeah, <laughs> you know, are, hard to believe, <laughs> isn't it? The days are going <laughs> they by. They are, they are. It's been a cool June though yeah. for us. What's our viewers club number? Number tonight 200-984 and our jackpot stands at $1,000. Check those card numbers. All right, Jamie, thank you. Well, if you're looking to stay cool, Missouri's K-12 